It's not the Brisbane water, but this view of Luzerne will surely do for former Mariner Oliver Bazanic. No, no, this isn't too bad at all. <laughs> it was quite an easy transition. Uh, you know, they're great people, uh, great place, and, and uh, also the, the club is great as well. Bazanic arrived in Switzerland in June, his second stint in Europe, though even Crocodile Ollie couldn't have imagined the early impression he would make. He didn't score many times in Australia, but I saw that he has a nice uh, left foot. Very strong, technical. Er hat das technische, äh, taktische äh, Qualität. Er kann unter Druck gut Ballkontroll, gut passen. Äh, er ist torgefährlich äh, und er kann auf verschiedene Positionen natürlich auch äh, spielen. I'm playing more of a, you know, a number eight or a number ten, um, where I can with uh, with one defensive midfielder. So. Uh, straight away, you know, I'm able to get into the box. For me, it's it started that way, but you know, uh, obviously, it's uh, you know the first uh, few months in the season. So I just hope to continue uh, work hard and uh, hopefully, you know, continue to score and uh, and you know uh, do well for for Lucerne. Bizanic's last try at a European career ended in frustration in England's lower leagues, but this time around, the 24-year-old is determined to leave a lasting impression. I was very lucky to, to be at a, a great club with the great coaching staff uh, and work under Graham Arnold and uh, and uh, you know a great team and uh, we had you know a lot of success in the last three years, which which helped me uh, to to get back to Europe. The players from Australia they are uh, simple to to join a European team because the characters and mentality is, is a little bit like European players. In May, Zanik signed off from the Hyundai A-League in some style. Uh, at no point it felt like we were going to, to lose the game or, you know, we were we felt so, you know, so in control and, uh, you know, one of, one of the greatest moments in, in my football career to, you know, to win a grand final. The Mariners' grand final success after the heartbreak of seasons earlier, a significant milestone for the Central Coast product. It was such a long time coming for, for us and the Mariners. Um, you know, we've been there so many times before and, and, it, and it hadn't worked out. So uh, for us to, you know, to win that grand final was, uh, you know, definitely something special. Now the challenge for Bazanic is to fulfil the Socceroo qualities first identified by Pim Verbake in 2009. The son of four-time Socceroo Vic Bazanic is eager to make an impression in green and gold, having been capped at youth levels for Australia previously. I was in once before, uh, you know, a few years ago, and uh, I think, uh, you know, I'd love to, I'd love to be back in uh, in the Socceroos again. It's a, it's a World Cup year. Um, and uh, I definitely want to be in the squad for, for the World Cup. Uh, for me, it's, uh, it's definitely about working hard here and uh, performing for my club here. And, uh, and uh, you know, if, if I do well and continue to do well, then, uh, you know, um, I'm sure I'll get that opportunity. But what I've said has been said, the great opportunity to achieve it. That means that the in the national team to come and in Brazil to be.